Hello everyone, I'm Neil Lambert. I am the chairman of the North Attleboro Election Commission. I'm here to talk a little bit today about our town elections, which will be held next week. And I'd like to see as much participation as possible. And uh, I'm here to give you a bit of an education as to why you should come out to vote and how to go about doing it. This year is going to be on Tuesday, April 2nd at the North Attleboro High School in the gymnasium. Polls will be open from 7 a.m. till 8 p.m. This year we have uh, open seats on several committees, uh, two on the Board of Electric Commissioners, two on the Board of Public Works, a one-year unexpired term on the Board of Public Works that we need to fill, two on the Parks and Recreations Commission, and three seats on the School Committee. Go to the Massachusetts Secretary of State's website to verify that you're registered to vote in North Attleboro. You also can call our election office, speak with the staff there. They can confirm your registration status as well as check to make sure that you are an active voter and you haven't fallen to the inactive roles. So an absentee ballot is a way for people unavailable to vote on election day to uh, be able to make their voices heard. You can contact the election office here in North Attleboro to request an, an absentee ballot and with uh, a reasoning that you can't make it to the polls on election day, they will mail you a ballot or if you go to visit the staff in person, they can give you the ballot that day. Uh, absentee ballots will be available up until April 1st. So our election office is a tremendous resource. They can answer your question as to what precinct you're going to vote in. You can also ask at the polls on election day. At least make sure you have your identification with you in the event uh, you arrive and find out you're listed on the inactive rolls. You will need some identification there to uh, show who you are, but no, we don't require identification to, to vote and uh, you don't need to bring anything with you. One thing you can do is to watch here on North TV's government channel uh, where they will have live coverage starting at 8.30 on election night to tell us what the results are as they come in. You can go to the North Attleboro Town website at www.nattleboro.com or on the social media sites for North Attleboro and uh, results will also be published in the Sun Chronicle and the North Star Reporter after the elections are over. Poll workers are a vital part of the whole process and we're always looking for new poll workers to help us on election day and uh, surrounding times when we're counting other types of ballots and doing work in the office. But uh, you contact the election office, speak with Pat or Janet, and they will give you more information on how to become a poll worker here in North Attleboro. Keep in mind that the town elections are some of the most important elections that we have. Uh, these are the people who will decide many of the policies and, and procedures that affect our lives every day.